made it back home from the casino. Uh, my parents and I and Keith had a blast. Uh, it was a great time. It was very, very busy. Uh, of course, it's Valentine's Day, but it was so busy. Uh, there wasn't much opportunity to record clips for you guys. I apologize for that. But uh, yeah, it was just incredibly busy. Uh, I didn't have very good luck. I didn't win, but I still had a great time with my parents and Keith. And yeah, it's all about having fun and making memories with loved ones and, and great friends and family. And yeah, it's never about the money or anything like that. So we, had, we all had a great, great time together. And yeah, the casino's the casino. Uh, <laughs> you go there to lose. I never expect anything of it. I just go there to lose and go there to have fun. But yeah, it seems like everybody was having a blast at the casino. Somebody won a Mini Cooper. That was cool. Uh, but yeah, it was just super, super busy. Uh, so just wanted to get you an update here. Uh, made it back home safe. I showered and all that for the evening. So it's time to unwind and get to bed here pretty soon appreciate you guys love you guys These the two clips i was able to get at the casino hope you guys enjoy them we definitely had a lot of fun god bless this is my late night snack i'm having some cereal also i just realized i uploaded my previous vlog without filming an outro so i apologize for that uh I uploaded it while we were at the casino because at that point it was already around 9 p.m. and I had to get my video uploaded and not having Wi-Fi at the casino I wasn't sure how long it was going to take to load a video because usually more times than not uh, Wi-Fi is faster to upload YouTube videos than uh, mobile data is so uploaded it on my phone my mobile data and uh, it went up uh, Went up before midnight, like I prefer, so that's a good thing. But yeah, I just thought that was funny. I was like, well, <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> record an outro. Sorry about that, guys. I had the cedar wood oil and the fur needle oil. Uh, finally ran out in the diffuser, so I just put some more water in it, filled it back up, and I'm using some rose essential oil and lavender essential oil as I'm getting ready to go to bed here tonight. Hey everybody, uh, just waking up here, getting my morning started. Uh, I didn't sleep very good last night. It wasn't horrible, but it wasn't the best sleep either. Uh, I wish I could have fell back asleep and slept in a little later. It's about 8.30. And, but it is what it is. I'm having some coffee and McDonald's for breakfast. Just wanted to get things going. I think I'm going to go ahead and get a shave this morning, uh, get that done for the day. I'm going to use my Davidoff Cool Water Shave Set, uh, of course the aftershave and the aftershave lotion and then my synth of the day is of course going to be Davidoff Cool Water. I'm going to water the seeds and water my plants here. I've been trying to make sure they get plenty of water. Of course, it's not very sunny today so far. Uh, as you guys can see, it's pretty cloudy out. But like I said, just want to make sure everything has water. Alrighty. Ah, a pop tree. And then a little bit for my cactus here. I don't recall ever showing you guys these before, but these are my uh, basketball shoes. They've really only ever been worn uh, indoors in the indoors basketball court. So they're in still pretty good shape. Uh, but yeah.
just wanted to get you guys a look at them. My friend TC just gave me a call. Uh, he said he's got something going on around 1 p.m. But he said we can possibly hang out today, so looking forward to that. I always enjoy hanging out with TC. He's a great friend, as well as John. Uh, when I get the chance to hang out with John, it's always a good time. I uh, really cherish and value my friendships that I do have. Uh, yeah, TC's a great, great friend. We've really had lots of fun times together, lots of great memories. But, uh, yeah, we'll see if we get to hang out with them today, hopefully. But, yeah, I got a hoodie on today because it is pretty cloudy and actually pretty chilly outside. But, yeah, I really love this hoodie. One of my favorites. And it's not one of my favorite hoodies for the reasons you guys might think. Uh, as most of you guys know, I'm not a big football fan. I don't really care for football. I never really have, but I may get into it in the future. Uh, you never know, but yeah, I don't watch college football. I don't watch pro football. Uh, the reason this hoodie is one of my favorites and so special to me is because it was a gift. And uh, any gift that I receive, I just cherish it. Whether it's a handwritten note or a seashell that somebody found at a beach or in this case a hoodie uh, gifts are just so sentimental to me uh, I just kind of get lost for words I don't really care about money or the price of things it's to me gifts it's the thought behind it that counts and every time I receive a gift it's just incredibly thoughtful uh, yeah, I just cherish the gifts. I love the cards and handwritten notes, and I just cherish all of it. It truly means a lot to me. Uh, I'm just a very sentimental person. Here's how to get freaking roasted. If I wore a OU hat, put it on quick if I can. All right. <laughs> wear an OU hat. <laughs> and wear an Alabama hoodie. Oh. Hanging out with my friend Keith here. Uh, we stopped at the gas station. He's going to get gas in his car. Yeah, gas is $2.89 for regular ethanol. Just wanted to get you guys a look at that. I got some cars on the trailer here. They're still wrapped up. Brand new, I believe. It's TC, man. So inspirational. Hey. So inspired. Oh my gosh, I just realized something. I got an Alabama hoodie. TC's got an OU shirt. <laughs> How's that first shot looking? Ah. Oh. Second one. There it is. Nice. So TC had to go get another ball. He got the ball stuck. He got it wedged. He's an inspirational potato wedge. There we go. Redemption arc. Woo! Just wanted to get you guys a different look here. Uh, this is the gym that you play basketball in. Uh, if you come out here, here's the entrance of the building. Uh, the office is right there. And then uh, here's a food court area, concession area. As you guys can see. And uh, there is a couple other gyms inside here water fountains uh in this gym here they play the new game pickleball as you guys can see the nets and then this is another gym it's not open today i uh, really don't know what they use that one for but uh yeah locker rooms supplies and then this is back to the gym one where you play basketball and then uh 
water fountains, and then of course the men's bathroom on this side. That's not a very big facility, but it is pretty nice, and I'm glad they have indoor basketball courts. Uh, that one used to be uh, another basketball court, but as you've seen, they converted it to pickleball because that's gotten pretty popular. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys a look at the uh, indoor uh, basketball courts here. But yeah, here is uh, a layout of what it looks like in here. I found a map hung up on the wall here. Hey everybody, just wanted to get you an update here. Been hanging out with my friend TC today. As you guys seen, got a few clips at the indoor basketball court. Then after that, we went back to to my house and watched quite a bit of anime. Uh, it's just past 6 p.m. right now. And uh, yeah, we watched quite a few episodes of One Piece. And as you guys know, <laughs> One Piece don't end. So <laughs> I'm just kidding, but it's a very long anime. TC now has a fragrance stand, and I love it. That is awesome. I'm so inspired by this. So inspirational. I am inspired, man. It's so inspirational. Yes, sir. My camera did not want to focus when I zoomed in. Focus. Thank you. That's a clone rational. Fragrance inspirational. Yeah. I thought that was just chocolate, bro. No. <laughs> was it the one with the white inside? Which one? Which one no, was the, it? The one that looks like chocolate. Like, yeah, that one. Yeah. The one that looks like chocolate. I know what black licorice tastes like. It's nasty. But why don't you like black licorice, man? And I'm one of the few in the whole wide world. I'm in the minority, but I love candy corn. So if you want to flame me for that, go ahead. I don't care. But black licorice, no, no. Comment down below. Do you like black licorice? Uh, I'm kind of neutral on it. I think it's all right. Uh, it's not horrible, but it's not good. I like the regular licorice better, but I still really not a big fan of licorice in general. Yep, camera doesn't do it justice. Another beautiful, beautiful sunset. My goodness. Northwest Oklahoma's on a roll <laughs> with the sunsets. They've just been gorgeous, as you guys know. If you've been watching my videos here recently, the sunsets have just been unreal. But I'm heading home from TC and John's. Had a great time with TC today. Uh, like I said, went out to the indoor courts, we watched anime at my house, hung out with TC and John back at their place, and yeah, it was nice to see them both and hang out for a little bit, so we'll talk to you later. Hey everybody, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm uh, going to wrap it up here and get my shower taken and relax for the rest of the evening. God bless you guys. Peace be with you.